What's going on guys, Ben Galena here coming back at you with another video on MLB 18 The Show Diamond Dynasty and got a haircut in case anyone cared to know. Uh, Mom says I look cute and that's kind of all that matters, uh, but figured I would change up the lineup a little bit, get some better players in here. So we're bringing out more of a traditional really good team. Now there are some golds in there obviously. There's a bronze uh, in Ryan Schimpf because he's basically a diamond. Someone wanted to see me use Manny Machado, so I'm like, I'll throw Manny Machado in. Also got Dante Bichette. Maybe this is an 88 Dante Bichette debut. I don't know. Here he is, if that's a thing. Um, got Mike Trout back in the lineup, only hitting 235 with him. I also figured I'd bring back Vlad, who I'm in 419 online with. So I'm like, mm, probably a good player to bring back. However, I am in pursuit of World Series. We are currently 813. And I'm like, all right, we're getting back up there. I need to maybe get a better team. To compete i know i'm still gonna have like a really good team uh but you know who knows want that robinson cano and i'm not that far from world series let me just uh come out here get a win let's play it minute made and uh let's go out here get a win do i want mustard with that maybe um nelson cruz orlando cepeda from conquest extreme uh mostly a gold and silver team with conforto and de Jong as well as Ian Desmond, Jim Edmonds, Gary Sanchez, Ryan Zimmerman, Zach Granke on the hill. We've got Carlos Carrasco, and hopefully another win in store in pursuit of World Series. 21-5 and five currently, looking for 22-5. and five. Let's get it. I threw a fastball right down the middle. I, I didn't really mean to. Should have played a warm-up game first. I was, I was right down the middle. And he, then he's taken the next two pitches. And they've been really close pitches. Wow, I'm totally going to lose. Totally going to lose. He worked a really good 3-0. And then just started swinging the bat. Which uh, looks to be his downfall. Because he smashed the fastball right down the middle. Alright, you should. That should be a home run every time. Why can I not locate at all? That's on me right now, I think. More so than... Uh, than anything else it's gonna be a decent spot there we go and we're down to the inning done all right cody bellinger leading off get me back in this game i mean we're still in it obviously but down one nothing is not the ideal start we're gonna try to be selective at the plate as well but you guys know me i am pretty aggressive at the plate with the bat in my hand so i'm gonna be swinging a lot probably three one should be seeing a really good pitch here we're going to take ball four. Not a bad start. Here's Vlad Guerrero. We didn't see good pitches with Cody Bellinger. Guess what we're not seeing with Vlad Guerrero. That's a really, really good pitch as well. 2-2 two -two to Vlad. I'm going to go back to regular swinging. And that's a pretty good curveball. All right, double play situation is off. And we're going to try to take three with Cody Bellinger. We got it. Vlad did his job, got Cody Bellinger over to third, and here's Mike Trout, who I am not hitting well with. Was crushing it with him in BR, and just haven't seen that in ranked seasons at all. All right, worked another walk. And here is Dante Bichette. I think most of these stats are offline, if not all of them. I use him in BR a little bit, and all I need from him here is not to ground out into a double play. So I'm going to steal with Mike Trout. I'm actually going to do a hit and run here. And Mike Trout's going to have to get back. And that should score a run, though. Nelson Cruz has got a hose. But he just doesn't have the accuracy. And we score a run. Tie ball game. I mean, I centered that up with good timing. I don't, I don't really know why that was such bad contact. And I'm going to swing first pitch, which I don't know why. It was a good spot, but couldn't do much with it. What, really? I was a little bit early on my release, so that hung hung a bit, but like that was off the plate, was it not? Ah, uh, you know, that, that's a good spot on that pitch. Um It just it hung up a little bit. I kinda wanted it more in that location. More so than just up, but early release, and I don't like I don't know how that goes over there. <laughs> Alright, he's got a lead back after the homer somehow. That he blasted away and I I was not ready to swing. Power swung on that. Right down the middle, I pulled down. Want to continue to get that pitch count up. 
29 already in the bottom of the second, but this inning was a lot less patient than the first, and Machado's going to fly out deep to left field. Yeah, you can tell immediately off the bat there was no way that, no way that was going. That's going to be a good pitch. Up the middle. React to this, Machado. Get the arm going. Can't even pick up the fucking ball. Right? What are you... Wow. Schimpf is unbelievable. <laughs> that w that could not have been more right to him. And that is grounded right back up the middle. <sighs> wow. I can't believe there's still no outs. Dude, he's just hitting every single thing right back up the middle. There's nothing I can do. I'm, he takes them if they're out of the zone. And, I mean, even there. Just right back up the middle every time. I'm getting sauce with Carlos Carrasco. This guy just takes everything, dude. That's my issue, is I'm, I'm trying. And he's just taking everything. And, um, we get two outs, though. Down five. What? We're going to have to put together a pretty good comeback. Come on, Vlad. Yeah. More runs will score. Six to one on the RBI double. I don't know why I just didn't intentionally walk him. I got to I gotta think more. Because that's Zach Greinke. And maybe it's only five to one. If I intentionally walk him, we don't give up an RBI double. Vlad is so slow in right field. I don't know what it is. I think Carrasco's done. Do I go to the bullpen already? We'll, we'll leave him in for another inning. There's Carrasco. That's a good start. That is a single base hit out in the center field. And now we have Cody Bellinger coming up. One swing of the bat makes this a lot more manageable with Cody. A lot more manageable. His OPS is 1.63. And that's going to be a base hit. That's going to score a run as well. We're going to stop Vlad at first because he's pretty much like an auto double with a steal. I'm going to take the run though. Probably not going to steal with him. Well, we'll see. Here's Mike Trout. Only down 6-2 now. There's Vlad headed to second. And as I said, pretty much an auto steal every time with him. He's got the speed. Here's 3-1 and one to Trout. Base hit should score. Vlad. But we're going to take a walk. Double play is back on, but here's Dante Bichette. I don't know how he didn't homer last time he was up. He got right on it. Flew out to right center. There's Dante Bichette. That's going to be a base hit. We're going to send Vlad. And we're going to go ahead and keep... Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. back to first. Back to first. Back to first. I, I fucked up there. Fucked up. Dante Bichette just set it a second. And I didn't mean to send a uh, send Trout to third there. I'll take the run. A little bit annoying that I don't have first and second with one out right now. But that's that's my fault a little bit. I kind of freaked out on the base path when Dante Bichette started headed to second. Heading, heading, heading. What am I saying here? That's a really tough pitch to hit. Didn't want to go after it. We're going to go back to regular. And there, that's going to score a run. That's got to drop. It's not going to drop. Damn it. All right. We're back in this game a little bit. I need Carlos Carrasco to settle down and stop letting this guy just completely pound me. That's a great start. And he smashes that. That's a fair ball. Uh, double. Everything I throw with Carrasco just elevates. Even with good timing. Except, I don't, I don't know. Carlos Carrasco, my review of him so far, uh, I'm going to say terrible. I'm going to say he's absolutely awful. One of the worst pitchers I've used. Maybe next to Vital Blue. Vital Blue is a 93 overall. And currently with, with you know, pitch speeds and everything like that, Vital Blue is not usable. And... Do you see what I'm talking about with this guy and just taking pitches? And then fucking with good timing anyway, Carlos Carrasco just randomly hangs a slider. And now he's going to walk or pound it late for a hit. Dude, 
Good timing down in the zone. And Carlos Carrasco elevates a fucking changeup. People go, oh, Bengal, stop complaining. It'd be a lot more of an enjoyable video for you and everyone else. How am I, like, it's not enjoyable. That's the fucking reason I'm complaining. When Carlos Carrasco is going to hang a changeup right down the fucking middle when I'm already getting smashed. Down 9-3 to because Carlos Carrasco is fucking garbage. Why are every one of my pitchers hanging pitches so badly? It's a slider with a good release when I'm putting that thing down. And it's just going, nope, right down the middle, right down the middle, right down the middle. How? <laughs> How? There's Ryan Schiff. No doubter. <sighs> Nine to what? Four is it now? It's not over, but... It's going to be tough to come back, man. There's Machado. That's not going to drop, is it? Oh, it is. That's a gap shot with Manny Machado. That's three. Oh, he's so slow. He got it, though. That's got to be run, too. Basically, I'm going to say this is nine to five. We're going to bring in Ken Griffey Jr. Silver, 79. I think it's better than the 88 just because he has power. Oh, my God. Ken Griffey Jr. is going to get first, right? I didn't manage to score off that. Just kind of seeing how that would play out. I feel like our odds to get him in now are much lower. But runners on first and third, only one down. And there's Bellinger. Is that a home run? That's deep center field. That's gone. Off the batter's eye. Cody Bellinger. 9-7. to seven. Power swing. Vlad Guerrero. It's going to go deep to left center, and it's going to be a fly out. Two underneath it, I guess. Man. Two underneath it, I guess. On a power swing. Are you... Dude. This is what I'm talking about. Like, I, I, I hate to sit out here and complain in these videos because I know you guys don't like that. What am I supposed to do when I have the best fucking card in the game? <laughs> Power swing, center up a ball, and I fly out. 3-0 to Mike Trout. I power swung on that. I probably just should have taken an eventual walk. Would have been the third time he walks Mike Trout in this game. Oh, man, 9-7, to seven, though. Game is far from over. I don't know how he does it, but every time I throw it like a curveball down, slider down, it just doesn't even matter how bad the contact is. It's just right back up the middle every single time for a hit. It's so frustrating. That's got to be a double play. Justin Smoke rounds out into a double play. Runner moves to three for Ian Desmond to come up. I brought in Lee Smith to face Justin Smoke. Need to get out of this inning. Great pitch. We go cutter away. Force a ground ball. Too far. It's being a good cutter. And we got him to pop up. He got underneath it. No runs allowed that inning. A rarity so far in this game. And we're still in this. Got to come back. I really would like to take the lead in this inning. We're going to be facing Chris Davinsky. Chris Davinsky. All right. I really can't believe this guy's dropped nine runs on me in five innings. <laughs> it's so many. Like, my ERA is like a little high, I feel, and it's like a 276. And that has shot up, I would say, considerably after this game where, uh,. I can't catch a break, clearly. Oh, Lindor's going to be able to take second on the wild pitch. Double play is off. Elgari at the plate. Extra base hit. Any type of base hit might score Lindor, actually. Getting Elgari on the base path would be nice. Oh, my God. He hung that and I missed it. 2-2. Two -two. Got to make contact. Faked him out. Faked him out. Throw canceling was on. We got him back, though. Here's Ryan Schimpf. Runners on first and second after the finesse. One down. No double plays. Home run would be killer. 
There it is. Ryan Schiff, get out of here. We take the lead. Let's go, baby. That's the best card in the game. 69 Ryan Schimpf. Nice. 434. And we have the lead. 10-9. Machado! Get out of here, baby! 11 to 9. Machado off the railroad tracks. If not even over. I'm gonna leave in uh, Lee Smith as well. Game is far from over, though. We know that. This guy can score some runs. That's going to be a long fly out with Bellinger. I don't think that has a distance at all. He's going to the warning track. There's no way. Wow, that, that had some carry on it. What's the win like? What is the win like here? Oh, six miles per hour is out. That explains a little bit how uh, so many of these balls are leaving the yard, I guess. And I just left a fork ball over the plate. Jim Edmonds homers, 11 to 10. I told you, like, it's just far from over. It's going to be like a 20. Yeah, like, look at that. It's going to be like a 20 to something game. He's scoring 20 runs on me, I think. Oh, my God. Stop hitting the ball. I don't know. I don't know what to do. He's crushing me. It's a slider low. It's like... I don't even feel like that's a bad spot. Uh, how is that not a strike? It's basically, I'm choosing how do I want him to score runs. I, mean, I missed the spot on that one. Do I want him to, A, hit continual bombs off me? Like, obviously not really. Two, do I want him to hit ground balls up the middle that manage to uh, get runs on the board as it is now 11 to 11? Or do I want to walk him in? I have choices. Like, that's an early, weak hit. That's gotta, that's gotta be two. Please turn this, Schimpf. Got him. Double play. Uh... <laughs> and that's gonna be the inning, provided we can get there with Cody Bellinger, and he actually secures the catch he does. It is 11 to 11 in Minute Maid Park right now. For Vlad Guerrero, his average has moved down a little bit as he is one for three today. And we're likely not going to face Davinsky again. Who is this? Brad Peacock. Seeing a lot of Astros. Slash former Astros, potentially. I don't know who else is in his bullpen. Nope, no other Astros in there as far as I can see. Come on, Vlad. Should have had a homer. Last at bat. Absolutely should have. All right, 2-1 count. Not going to see a meatball, but we might get something in the zone we can go after. Going to be 3-1. He obviously doesn't want to face Vlad, and why would you? That's going to be ball four. Knuckle curve is off the plate. And here is Mike Trout. And Vlad's got it. <sighs> Double play balls off. 3-0 count again to Mike Trout. That's going to be ball four. He walks again. On base percentage is skyrocketing for Mike Trout for Dante Bichette. Let's get something going here, boy. That is a fastball up, and that is a fastball gone. Dante Bichette just scrapes over the wall, and we are up 14 to 11. That was a fastball just out of the zone that we reached up for. And that train is still moving. Lindor Get out ball Travel no Oh it's off the wall Nelson Cruz had no idea Lindor's headed to 3 and he's got it We gotta score Lindor as well I need to pound him into submission here Because I know he's gonna keep scoring runs We gotta make it so he loses you know All the wind in his sails man I need to keep hitting the ball Come on El Gary The Kraken The Sanchez Gary Sanchez, come on. 2-0. That's going to score the run. All right, El Gary is out at first. I didn't slide to first like an idiot. I was going with Lindor in case uh, he threw it home. We go up 15-11. to 11. And here's Ryan Schimpf. 
He's homered twice in this game already. I'm never going to swing at that. That's a really good pitch. Oh, just on top of it with Ryan Schimpf. That might have been headed into the right field seats if I was a bit more underneath that one. Unfortunately not. As you can see, yeah, just early and on top of it. We're going to head into the next inning. <laughs> Trying to shut this guy down, and it has been difficult, let me tell you. Let me try to put this fastball inside. Push the fastball inside, and got the out. This is a great start to this inning. <laughs> Another good spot on the fastball. That's going to be out number two. I don't believe what I'm seeing. We might have an inning where we don't allow a run. There we go. We can't, We got through an inning without allowing a run. I don't know how long this video is going to be. There are highlights for, and lowlights, I guess, for days. But uh, this has not been a fun game to play. I'm not even... I'm not going to lie. This has not been a fun game. I've been freaking out man because i went down by a lot early and i you know the wind was taken out of my sails we're gonna bring in jim edmonds he's homered for our opponent let's continue the trend keep homering wind still pushing out straight that's a very interesting spot for the curveball i might have been tempted Jim Edmonds, get out of here. It's gone. Holy cow, dude. You guys are going to be telling me to raise the difficulty after this one like you are my Braves franchise. This is the most runs I've ever scored in an online game. It's also like up there with the most runs I've ever given up. Three and one to Bellinger. And that's going to be, that's going to carry and be out probably, right? He's going to dive. Cody Bellinger's got at least three. That is to the deepest part of the park, pretty much. Cody Bellinger, we're going to stop at three with him. And in is going to stride Vlad Guerrero. Vlad the Impaler. Officially one for three on the day. And I'm going to power swing. That is so gone. Get out. Vladimir Guerrero, Vlad the Impaler. Vladdy goes deep. The score is 18 to 11. Stante Bichette right back up the middle. I'm improving my averages a little bit this game. Improving my slugging percentage. ERA is, is not going in the right direction. But here is Francisco Lindor. Triple and a single. Oh man, I wanted that one. I think it was a little bit late. Yeah, I was late on that and missed it. Here's El Gary back up again. Chop that one. Advances the runner to second for El Gary, who is uh, hitless today. Let's change that. El Gary to El Gap. RBI double for him. Dante Bichette scores, and it is 19 to 11. I don't even I don't even know how to react to this game as Ryan Schimpf strolls up to the plate. Two homers already for him. Let's get three. Oh my goodness. I thought that was gonna hang up a bit more. On top of it, we're gonna ground out. That's gonna be a shot as well. Oh man, this wind is wild. You guys imagine being in a game where you're up by eight runs and you don't feel comfortable? That's exactly where I am right now. I do not feel comfortable, and I'm up. I have 19 runs scored. Schimpf, you are horrific in the field. <laughs> it's going to be interesting. I wonder if Ryan Schimpf uh, costs me more runs than he actually gets me. I know he has two home runs this game, and he's a beast. As we get lucky there. You want to catch this one, Ryan? <laughs> Great job, buddy. Oh, El Gary just crushes it right center field. You guys are going to see this pitch spot. I mean, if you didn't see it already. And that is a changeup. I guess that hung up there a little bit. 13 to 19. This, this is Andrew Miller. All right, strike two to Nelson Cruz. I'm going back to the slider. Trying to bury this one inside. That's going to be pretty good location. We get a ground ball to third base. Machado is there. 
and extinguishes the fire that was uh, was blazing a little bit in that inning. Bottom of the eighth, we have the opportunity to put this one away. All I have to do is score four runs, which I've done each of the last four innings, and this game is over by mercy. It is possible. And there's Manny Machado. That's going to have a shot. Get off the wall. It's going to. Manny Machado with a double. Does he have a does he have a double, a triple, and a homer? Is Manny Machado now a single away from the cycle? He might be. We're going to bring in Nelly. Nelson Cruz to face whoever he has on the mound. Sean Doolittle. Hopefully he continues to do a little. Ah, oh, and I swung first pitch. That was a really good slider. Wanted to attack it. There's Nelly. That's going to be down the line. And we're going to advance the runner to three. So we are still threatening. Again, I don't feel safe with any lead that I have. As Cody Bellinger is going to come up. I just missed that one with Nelson Cruz, I guess. Not quite on it. Didn't quite have the timing. Should be able to score a run here, though. I didn't expect that pitch. There's Bellinger. That's going to score the run. Deep to center field. Machado, yeah, there's no chance for the throw. There's no chance. Here's Vlad Guerrero against the lefty. I don't know if I like this matchup for you, Sean. I don't know if you want to throw anything close to the strike zone. Okay, challenged me. He challenged me with a low fastball. I didn't want it. I like that one, though. Vlad Guerrero off the train tracks. Home run number two. Love to see that train moving. Here's a 2-0 count to Trout. Gets a great call on the line. I don't think I got that call earlier. I don't know if I'm going to include this clip. There's going to be a lot of action. Trout has walked three times. Should, maybe should have even been four. But I swung at a, a bad pitch. And I power swung there. And I'm going to fly out again. I cannot hit with this Mike Trout. All right. Top of the ninth, Kenley. All I need you to do is close this out for me, man. All you have to do is not allow eight runs. That's a great start. Ryan Schimpf actually fields his position. One down. You can go cutter. Same spot. Got him chasing. That's going to be two down. I can't believe this. <laughs> and he is going to a pinch hitter. I'm going to throw that sinker away. That's a great spot. Got him chasing. One strike away. I'm going to go cutter. Outside. Didn't get the spot. Mm, that cutter hung over. He makes good contact. You got to get there. That's fair ball. He might be out at two. Dante Bichette has no arm. Come on, dude. Can we just end this game? He's brought in Pee Wee Reese. I'll throw you fastballs. I challenge you to hit this, this ball. Yeah, there we go. Schimpf catches it. Game over. <sighs> Sigh of relief. Vlad Guerrero is the player of the game. And you could have chosen a lot of players here. That was that was a wild game. That is the most runs I've ever seen in any ranked seasons game ever. That game was crazy. If you guys have scored more in a game or allowed more in a game, let me know. But I'm going to say this is the most runs ever scored in a ranked seasons game. I've never seen close to this. But thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed, and I will see you in the next one. Take it easy. Shit, don't run away.